Greetings and salutations! Today is a quick video because I am still in the queue for Warcraft, so we're gonna quickly do a video and we are going to do cows! So, like with, I'll just clear up an area here, like with chickens and pigs and sheep and all of that, um, you do need to clear an area for a fence. Um, however, they are one of the animals where you will use uh, wheat, not seeds. So you have that go going for you. Okay, I see one over there. So let's uh, build a nice little area for the cows. My mouse is just not licking me right now. I'm gonna have to add some dirt, I think. bit longer than the chicken one. But. And we will throw down a door! Yay! Okay, so now we have wheat. So I see one cow here. And they love to be spread out. Okay, so we're gonna go over here and grab this cow first. Did a bat get outside? That's not very nice. Okay. Come along, cow. Come along, cow. Come on, cow. Come along, cow. Let's go. Look at him just coming. Oh yeah, husband's here. It's Saturday, of course he is. Look at him just so like checking along. It's like, yep, I'm coming. I want your wheat. So this is gonna work exactly like chickens. We will Put, get two of them together and breed them and then they'll make a baby cow and everything will be adorable and nothing will hurt. Everything will be beautiful and nothing will hurt. Okay, so we've got two cows, but I'm also going to show you how to milk said cows, which sounds like it should be gross, but it's actually pretty straightforward and not very horrible at all. Alright. Let's make sure they don't fall down the hole. Oh, good. Okay. Come on, cows. This went way better than when I was trying to do chickens, but it's not as far, so that might have had something to do with it. So we will go here. Come on. Come on. Come on, cow. Let's go. Come on, cow. Come on, cow. Let's go. What the? Mm, not nice. Come on, cow. Ugh, cow. Okay, good. Come on. Okay. Excellent. So we'll close this off. So we will breed them first. So cow. And they'll kiss for a while and... Baby cow! Huh. Repopulation. What's up, cow? How you doing? Aren't you adorable? So, like I said, same size head, just smaller body. Now, the beautiful thing about cows is we can't do this with a baby. Oh, we can do this with... You can milk baby cows. That makes no sense. Never mind. So, kind of gross, each actually. cow <laughs> will get you milk. So you just right click on them with a bucket and you get milk and you use milk to make uh, cake, pretty much. And there's sugar cane over there. So because this is gonna be a shorter video, we're gonna do cows and sugar and cake, basically. So how you grow sugar cane is quite simple. First you need to find some. So we have three pieces, okay, good. And now we will farm it. Now there are a lot of ways to farm sugar cane. Um, I, there's a couple different ways you can do it. I find the most efficient. It needs to be touching 
um, one block of water. It's not as picky as, or it's about as picky as wheat. And there's like efficiency algorithms that you can figure out and they're on the website, but all I'm gonna do, oh, that's not what I wanted. All I'm gonna do is we're gonna put all this back. We're gonna put all this back. Those can go away. Those can go away. Those can go away. Those can go away. And we're gonna have our hoe. And I'm an adult, I swear. And grab some more dirt. Oh right, and we didn't keep the wood for that. So. All right, I guess. Oh my gosh, mouse, why are you so crazy? Okay. Let's try this again. I need the bone meal. Where is it? There it is. Okay, just for quick growing so I can show you how this all works. So, put that there. And we'll just fill in this area here. Not all of it, just some of it. This will do. So, again, I'm gonna get some wood. I want to make it look as pretty, but doing, um, I find that there's a more efficient way to do, takes up a little bit more room, but you get more, you get eight for one block of water as opposed to only two in this way. And I know there's, like I said, there's more algorithms, but I like to make my farm somewhat aesthetically pleasing. So, I'm just kind of fussy that way. And again, I'm only doing grabbing these so that I can make them look, make this look exactly how I want to because I'm kind of fussy on aesthetics when it comes to Minecraft because I have to look at it all the time. Whenever I play group Minecraft, and my husband will attest to this, I routinely say, okay, you guys go and get all the materials and I will build our house. Is that a fair statement? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and are my houses usually pretty cool? Yeah. That tree house you made in the jungle was pretty we cool. We spawned in a jungle biome, and so I we I made big connecting tree houses to all the big trees, and we were like in the trees and on top of the trees, and it was great. Okay, so that is 30. That should be enough. So, oh, it's getting dark soon. Okay, let's be quick about this. So we will do, I think, two, yeah, okay. So we'll go like this, and I'll put, wood in the middle, I think. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, we're not going to do that. I lied. Okay. Ha uh ha. -huh. Oh no, yeah, we can. Okay. No, I lied. Okay. I did. I, I'm such a liar. Okay. It's okay. We'll do this. Okay. So, for this one, two, three, four again. Time, which means monsters. I have to be quick. Okay, let's uh, go sleep for a minute and then I will come back and do this because I don't. What the? My mouse is just freaking out on me. Okay, let's go. There are not monsters nearby. I call shenanigans. Probably a spider on top of your house or something. It's usually what it I have seems a big tall be. roof though, so there shouldn't be. Yeah. No, there must be something outside. Oh. Okay, fine. Where's my sword? I will settle this. There's a creeper. I bet you it's either something underneath or something spawned between the top and the bottom of my roof because this is empty in there. Are there caves underneath here? Yeah, there's a cave underneath. There my is. House. Uh, I don't see anything either. 
Alright, well, I can't hear anything because I have uh, the Minecraft or the WoW music going in the background because I'm in the queue, so we're gonna break our roof. Oh, yeah, there's a skeleton <laughs> down there. How rude. There's two, three, and a zombie. Oh my god! There's a freaking monster spawn in your roof. Apparently. Okay. Like when they talk about ah! Boogie Man in your attic? Jesus. Did you see how high I jumped? <laughs> yeah. Okay. So you might want to put some torches up there or something. No <laughs> kidding. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. No, it's just I've never seen a roof with that many bad guys in it before. Me That's neither. That's crazy. Still more. There's one. Okay, yeah, we're uh Maybe you should just have a staircase up there. No. Nope. And have like an attic or something. No, I know exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna fill in the roof. You could do that too. Because that is way too creepy. Or at least make it like one high so nothing can spawn. Yeah. No, I actually I don't know if spiders might be able to spawn in that. You have the materials. Oh, I have lots of this, so yeah, we will just fill this up. Oh, crap. That was <sighs> terrifying. Jeez. Okay. But yeah, see, like, it goes fair- my roof goes fairly high. Yeah, it does. Uh, no, I don't- I don't have enough dire- I don't have enough granite. Okay, fine, we will put torches in then. Because holy crap, that was ridiculous. We probably won't need too many anyway. That's probably enough. Better safe than sorry. Alright, let's uh, get rid of this dirt. Jeez Louise. That was hysterical. Okay. Scary, but hysterical. So there's that. Alright, let's do this. Close my roof back off. Jesus. Okay. Let's go to bed. <laughs> this is why I don't play horror. This is why I don't play horror games. All right, let's make some torches, cause torches. All right, now. And all those guys are on fire. They're fine. They'll die soon. Oh, there's a spot. Shouldn't you be on fire? Or do spiders not go on fire? Maybe spiders, spiders don't do. go on fire. Okay. Well, Just the undead guys. Alright. Okay, so this is how this one's working. We need dirt we need more dirt than this. There's a creeper over there. Okay. I need to get my oh I have my book of water. Okay, good. I need more dirt. Do I not have any more dirt? That's disappointing. Okay, I need to go get some dirt. Okay, wait, wait. Are you kidding me? Quit bugging my cows. Do you have armor yet? Yeah, I'm wearing armor. See, you can see the armor logo on my screen. Oh yeah, you got lots. Quit bothering my cows. So rude. Me enough dirt. All right, shall we try this again? Okay, so what we're gonna do is you do them in groups of eight, like this. Actually, we can do this. Ah, creeper. No! You son of a biscuit. Okay. <sighs> Stupid creepers. Okay, let's try this again. Sigh. I mucked that up. Okay, never mind. We will do this. Okay, 
I think I think this will work if we do this. Yeah. Okay, it's gonna be a little uneven, but that's okay. All right, so what you do, you can do this with sand as well. Sugar cane will also grow on sand. Um, you're probably saying, do you what on sand, Abby? What are you talking about? So we do this, and we'll grab this, and we'll go there. We'll grab this, and we'll go there. And we'll grab this, and we'll go there. We'll grab this, and we'll go there. Actually, I don't Does sugar cane grow on dirt? I know it usually grows on sand, but I think it can grow on dirt. Let's, let's, let's look this up. Come on, internet, work with me. There we go, all right, and... This. Okay, yeah, they need to be planted on grass, dirt, sand, or red sand that is directly adjacent to. Okay, so that's the difference. When you grow wheat, um, the water can be underneath. So you can just have a whole field of it and have a layer of water underneath with um, sugar cane. They need to be, uh, actually I should grab more water because I'll probably need that later. Um, they need to be directly adjacent. So we do this. And I believe, there. Okay, so no, we don't. Well then, that's a little weird. Fine, we'll do this. I know exactly what we'll do. We'll just do it backwards. So we'll do, this and we'll just I'm so doing this backwards and that is okay now we will use bone meal oh no you can't use bone meal on this okay anyway so this is how it's gonna work so, this is how we're gonna do it so we're gonna do two rows of it with one same as we're doing with okay they changed how you can do this then that's a little not nice but that's okay Usually when you walk over this, it stops being dumb. But okay, anyway, so you'll plant it and it will grow because it's adjacent to water. And I don't know why I can't use sugar, I can't use bone meal on this. That I totally thought you could, which is making me very sad. Okay. Nope. Pretty much everything good, though, it looks like. All right, then. Okay, so you just let it grow, and they'll grow up to three high. They'll max out at four high, but it's very, very rare that you will actually see it go four high. Um, so once you do, you just break off the top two pieces, and you just plant them. So, yeah, that's how that works. But that is pretty much it. I'm gonna just let me move this all around so that it kind of starts working. And yeah, so this will look just like this, but we'll have sugar cane. And yeah, it's a shame that I can't. So yeah, eventually it'll be just straight. And you don't have to hoe it. I thought you did, but you don't. You don't have to actually like till the ground. Um, the rest of them I think you do, but you don't have to with these ones. So that is it for today. So with sugar cane. Um, you can turn them into, actually I'll just break this so I can show you because I don't actually have to, I don't actually have to do it to show you. Let's put our crafting table down. So you can turn them into sugar. One piece will give you, one piece of, sh one piece of this will give you one piece of sugar. Or three in a row will give you three pieces of paper which you use to make books. Um, you will use them to make maps, things like that. So it's a good time. All right, and one, two, and three. Okay, so there we go. Let's, uh, oh, oh, yeah, let's check in on our chickens and see how they're doing. I, don't, I have one seed on me, that's not really gonna help me. That's okay, I will uh, grab as many eggs as I can. Eggs, eggs, oh, three eggs. Let's see if we spawn a chicken. Yay, that's what I wanted to show you. I'm so glad that worked. So you have a one in something chance, I don't know, it's not a very high number, of uh, if you smash an egg on the ground for it to spawn a chick, and it worked! Yay! Alright, 
So that is it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. You know the deal. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.